Bill and I have, of course, been witnesses to Ariel and Danny's extended dress rehearsal for Married Life. The show opens officially tonight for what promises to be a record run with the distinct possibility of a growing cast of characters. Sun refused to shine. And I would still be loving it. When mountains crumbled to the sea, there would still be you and me. Everybody's been talking about uh, the 10 years that. Uh, this wedding culminates, but I, I can claim credit to, to having the first sight of Ariel. I was present at her birth, cut the umbilical cord, but before I did, I saw the very top of her head emerge, and I knew that I was a father again. It's great to, after three decades or more, to be here tonight and, and to see her and Danny married. It's just, just a wonderful thing. The first night I met Ariel, I was at Frenchie's, I was with Danny. In comes walking in Ariel. Mine and Danny's eyes both lit up. So Danny grabs me and he says, listen, stay away from this one. <laughs> I want to say a couple of words about uh, uh, Ariel. Uh, understandably, I'm her father, and I, ha I, I have a lot of pride, and, but she's an unusual person. Uh, her dynamic approach to life, her enthusiasm, uh, her caring, her intelligence, her ingenuity, her ambition, and her love of family. And for the last decade of Danny, that multi-talented young man who is now officially part of our family. I've known Daniel for almost 20 years. We share many memories and many more events that although we may have experienced them together, we had such a good time that more often than not, we don't remember everything. He's a good person, a Mr. Fix-It, a very influential part of my adolescence, to say the least. And as an adult, a man that I am proud to call a dear friend. From the, the very beginning, they knew what they wanted. They knew where they were headed, right? It wasn't a straight road, necessarily. It wasn't the quickest of roads. It wasn't the easiest road, but they always knew where they were headed, and they always knew what they wanted, and that was, of course, each other. to know about how to live, love, and what to do, and how to be, I learned not in my three years of marriage, but at camp. All of this insight was not gained at school, but on the fields and in the bunks of Skodak. These are some of the things I've learned. Share everything. Do your job during cleanup. Say you're sorry when you hurt someone. Playing in the rain is good. Walking in the rain is great. Listening to the rain with someone special is even better. Rest hour is an important part of the day to regroup and put things in perspective. Be spirited. Cheer your friends, they become your family. Sing your heart out. The song will be more special if you add your own lyrics. Little gifts for no reason are the best. Never give up. Compromise is necessary. And the stars at night are big and bright. Remember to look up and appreciate them. They are, after all, the rarest of diamonds. They are your dreams. Chase them.
time flies when you're having fun. Treasure your memories, and you will always stay forever young. Kind woman, I give you my all. Kind woman, nothing more. Little drops of rain, whisper of the pain. Tears of love lost in the days gone by. Our love is strong, with you there is no wrong. Together we shall go until we die. My, my, my. Inspiration's what you are to me. Inspiration, look, see. And so today, my world smiles. Your hand in mine, we walk the miles. Thanks to you, it will be done. For you to me are the only one. Happiness, no more be sad. Happiness, I'm glad. If the sun refused to shine, then I would still be loving it. And if the mountains crumbled to the sea, there would still be you and me. This has been a reading from the book of Led Zeppelin. Today is the day that Daniel and Ariel will formally and publicly make their promises to one another. Although this is indeed a high point, marriage is much more than any one single event or promise. It is a series of decisions that have been made that show care and concern for the individual that they love most in the world. Marriage is a promise that is renewed daily through a couple's actions and a responsibility taken on in the spirit of hope and love that brings comfort in times of sadness and heightens our greatest joy. Repeat after me. Wear this ring. Wear this ring. As a symbol. As a symbol. Of our everlasting love. As our everlasting love. And my devotion to you. And my devotion to you. As your husband. As your husband. From this day forward. From this day forward. Ariel? Yes. Repeat after me. Wear this ring. Wear this ring. As a symbol. As a symbol. Of our everlasting love. Of our everlasting love. And my devotion to you. And my devotion to you. As your wife. As your wife. From this day forward. From this day forward. <laughs> Forty-eight hours ago, that Harley Davidson that's outside that Danny rolled up on was in a billion pieces. Okay, forty-eight hours ago. But I mean, when it comes down to it, my man, he gets it done. I mean, the kid gets it done. So. Ten years in the making, he's been fascinating, all right? Ten years now, we've been waiting. When's he gonna marry Ro, man? When's he gonna marry Ro? But sure enough, as you can see, he gets it done. You know what I mean? Uh, uh, in the idea of the one, that there was one perfect man out there for me. I just didn't necessarily think I would find him. And then there you were. I'm pretty sure I knew you were the one almost immediately, just from the way I felt simply meeting you for lunch or walking into Grand Central Station and knowing that you were there waiting for me. And now, 10 years later, my heart still skips a beat when you walk in the door when you come home at night. 
and my toes still curl when you kiss me. You are the man who has shown me what true happiness feels like, and you are undoubtedly my one. From this day forward, I am your family, and I promise to be your biggest fan, your loudest cheerleader, and your rock-solid foundation supporting you no matter what our life brings. You are my best friend, my true love, and my only gentle one. I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you by my side. I love you. Ariel, Relish, Rel, you are called by different names by many different people. But to me, my girl, my best friend, my everything, and right about now, my wife and my friend. You do so much for so many, but what you do and have done for me, no one else will ever know, or could ever understand. Through all my ups and downs, and we all know how numerous they are, you hold me up when I am weakest, you catch me when I'm falling, you are calm when I am crazy, and patient when I am late. Riding here late, I knew I was going to walk into your smile and your open arms. How do you do it? Baby, I am amazed at the way you love me all the time, and I am more amazed at the way I love you. My love for you has grown stronger every day, and even after 3,657 days, I can stand here now, look into those eyes, and know it will still grow stronger every day to come. Baby, you are my unsung hero, and I will love you and support you for the rest of our lives. I only hope it comes close to what you have already shown me. Because, even in my hardest times, I can rest my head just knowing that you are mine. <laughs> like it? <laughs> <laughs> Now that Daniel and Ariel have joined themselves to each other through vows and by the giving and receiving of rings, I do now, by the power vested in me, by the Universal Life Church and the great state of Pennsylvania, pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride.